Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Metronic. In this video, we're going to discuss on how we can globally change the font size within Metronic. So first thing we need to do is, of course, purchase and download Metronic. Once you've done that, unzip it and it will look something like this. Open this folder with your IDE. Of your choice, we're using Visual Studio Code. Now, if you haven't seen our overview for our Metronic SUS uh, file structure, we suggest you to have a look at that first before we get into this for you to further understand how we structure our SUS files. Uh, if you have already done that, then this is what you need to do to update the font size. So if you go into our source, um, basically demo, demo one or any demo, and then source and then SUS, then go into layout, go to variables, and you see font sizes here. So all you need to do now is just to change this number. So by default, Metronic's using 13 point, um, or 13 pixels for the desktop mode, and then 12 pixels for both tablet and mobile. So let's say that we want to switch it up. We want to make the, the, um, the desktop uh, font size to something bigger, something larger to say, 16 points. So let's go ahead and do that and just save that and then um, compile the assets. So to compile it, let's go to our theme, go to HTML, go to tools, open up the command prompt, and then run our gulp command. Of course, you can use um, our webpack method as well by just typing in web, uh, npm run build and then dash dash the demo name. All right, that's done. Let's go ahead and run our localhost so we can preview it. Right. And as you can see, things are a little bit bigger. Um, let's have a look at our default live demo. And here you can clearly see the comparison that the localhost one is now a lot larger than uh, the default because we increased it by, um, what is it, five pixels, three pixels, something like that. So, but if we do a quick inspect and then we do uh, to look in different, say, devices or different responsive um, widths, if you go to a tablet mode, you see the fonts gets reverted to the default Metronic uh, size. That's actually because we didn't change any of this. So let's say if we want to change this to say 14 on mobile, or for tablet, and then 12 on mobile, we can do that as well. Let's go ahead and run our gub command again with a new command prompt because we are running our localhost there. So gulp. All right, let's look at our local. Do a quick refresh. As you can see, on mobile, it's bigger. Like on desktop, this is, um, um, what do we put again? We put 16 points or 16 pixels. And then when we go to tablet mode, it becomes 14. And then we go to mobile, it goes to 12. So. That's pretty much it for this video. I hope you find this video informative. Give us a like if you did. Um, uh, please subscribe to our YouTube channel so that next time we release a new video, you get an update. Please follow uh, our social medias. Uh, links will be in the description below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.